I attended the session uh, with Leo Marmol uh, because it, like the rest of the sessions, uh, just felt like a, a really great way to hear from a practitioner about uh, things um, specific to his firm as well as kind of to the practice as a whole. Um, as, a, as a practitioner, he had a lot of insight about um, the, the way his firm kind of has come together and evolved over the years. Um, and. Uh, it was a, gr a great learning experience. There's a lot that goes on in Architecture Uncensored that, that people don't talk about in, in an office setting. And I say this kind of as, a, as someone a little bit apart from the profession. Um, there's so much rich architectural discourse uh, that happens in uh, chat rooms, online communities, uh, things like that, um, but a little bit less so in the office because everyone's focused on getting their work done, right? So Architecture Uncensored is a great way for people to get together after hours and talk about the things that they maybe don't get to talk to one-on-one -on -one with the, the people they work with every day, but are on their mind because there's so much going on in the profession at the, at the moment. The mission of the Emerging Architects Committee is to uh, provoke practice. Um, and it's very um, uh, apropos that the uh, Architecture and Sensor series is uh, the, one of the ones that we're really documenting because we believe that one of the um, main components or one of the main duties emerging architects have to the profession is to provoke it, to challenge it, and to uh, help people to think outside the box. Why we're documenting this process and uh, trying to spread the word about Architecture Uncensored is we're uh, it's a great program. I, I, I attended uh, four of the five sessions and learned something from each one of them. Um, and I think that everyone else who attended learned just as much as I did, if not more. And uh, it, it's a real value to people in the DC area, to people in the DMV, to come and hear practitioners speak about uh, how they've gotten to where they are or what they wish they'd done differently, things that you might not uh, pick up in uh, in, in kind of a day-to-day -day setting. The people who speak at Architecture Uncensored don't leave their professionalism behind, um, but they do add a level of sin sincerity uh, and honesty to the conversation that is extraordinarily valuable to younger people who are just kind of coming into their own as, as architects, uh, as emerging architects, um, hopefully later leaders in the profession, who uh, you know, have, have a lot to learn from, from people who are going to speak honestly about their own experiences.